Hi folks. Alexa, what date is it? Today is Sunday the 3rd of September. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 3.37am. Okay, so it's about... I forgot what time I did it before. It's about an hour and a half since the last time. I was on here this morning. I'm just enlarge it. It's moved around in the skyline upon a sort of pathway. They follow a pathway. There's the moon. What is it? Mm. Okay. And there's another craft. Conscious the circle. Let's see if I can move that. Get it in shot. Anyway, there's always, like I keep explaining, if you see one, um, there's others around that, that are cloaked. My family, let's just flash there. I'm going to expand it as much as I can. See it moving up and down, moving around, and like I said previously to the pre to the naked eye, it's perfectly still. But saying that, um, I posted earlier, I did sort of see it moving around. And I said, "Oh, oh thank you, family." Um, I did see it moving around when I sort of got to normal vision to the naked eye, not through the camera lens. See it moving around. Can give you a shot of where I am so you can get sort of where I was previously. Now I'm in the bedroom. So you can see where I am. Windowsill. Conversation in the windows. Oh, here we go. So, let's see. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Let's see two. Is that full moon? So I'm going to enlarge it as much as I can. So you can see two of them. Now I can't see the to make it I can't see the second one. I only can see the first one that's quite bright and that's the one to the left hand side of the screen and that's the moon is it the moon is that the moon I don't actually think it is that's the moon okay so it's that one there there's one there Second one's gone. There's one there. Is it flashing? Oh, here we go. And there's one there. So you both in a shot. Hi, family. They're moving in sync. Is that a reflection of the light from my window sill? Yeah, I'm not going to stay long, folks. Not today. So this one's definitely Consciousness Circle. 
see it changing colours and moving around. And like I said, the creature beasts are always in the background. You won't be able to pick it up unless you've got really advanced um, technology, audio, wherever you're watching this and listening to this. The dregs of society. I'm not like family. Can you hear them? And literally they are the dregs. My family can affirm that. I'll go into it at a later on, a later time. That the lowest life form, life force there is in the universe, where one species will sacrifice itself so other species can feed off it. They're just food. Is that correct, family? all those involved in the system or why the food and who's feeding off them I'll go on to a later date probably next time it's going to continue from before um, but yeah when I say they've got entity attachments they have got entity attachments got demons attached and they're feeding off them now additional information that I've received is that some of them entity attachments want to kill them want to I mean, I don't want this video to get flagged want to literally are on them, feeding off them, um, to unlive them. Is that correct, family? So we've got entity attachments now that want to, purpose, that's the main purpose of being attached to these so-called humans, in inverted commas, is to unlive them. So they don't get a choice, and so they, like I keep saying, the narcissists, the parasites, the people who are not connected to the creator, that have linked themselves to a system, an energetic force, that are not linked to humanity. Sex offenders, narcissists, secret group, people part of the secret societies, etc., etc. People who are part of the system. They've sold their soul. I keep saying sold their soul, but they're not sold their soul, not even done that. But they've linked their energy to, and now, at this stage, they're not just feeding off them, not sort of getting pe um, entities, sorry, sorry, Baba, entities that are feeding off them. The entity attached to them that want to literally unlive them, 